Hi guys. Uh, I'm here to uh, share my thoughts and opinion about the new Z coming up. They're gonna be dropping soon here. Um, I'm very happy to see Nissan dropping twin turbo again. Um, I'm a big fan of Z's, and I, I'm a big fan of those uh, 300ZX also because they're they're the only uh, Z that had twin turbo I mean you can put you can customize twin turbo and the uh, 350z but you have to customize it yourself I'm talking about stock okay so another thing is this is the 370z right here this is mine okay another thing is this one got a VTAC in here I don't know if they're gonna put a VTAC and twin turbo for the new Z. Uh, they didn't say too much. All we know is gonna be a twin turbo, back wheel drive. So this is not gonna share the whole um, entire performance about engine or everything else yet. I don't, I don't know why, but. They have their reason, so I'm not gonna ask. You know the 350Z and uh, the 370Z, the symbol is right there. Um, the new Z, the symbols are toward the back. I remember back in the day, um, I don't know if I know that they consider the 240 as a Z, um, I guess. But f for what I know is they have the 200 SX, okay? And then they got the 240 SX. And then they got the um, 280Z something. I don't know if it's a ZX, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, you can look it up if you want. I'm actually just talking. I'm not using computer. I'm not at home. I'm sure my true thoughts and what I know. Okay. So <clears throat> in the eighty, they dropped the um, single turbo three hundred ZX in the eighties. The twin turbo didn't come out until 1990. And then the um, 350Z has no VTEC, no turbo until Nisa came back on this car right here. It's VTEC. So I don't know, there's a Z before. Also got a VTEC. I'm not sure. I I drove a few of them, but uh, I don't think they have VTEC until this one. And I didn't really care where they put the symbol at, in the back or where it was. This time. You know what I prefer? I prefer Nissan put a. You see the symbol right here? It says Nissan. If they take that out and they put a big Z right there and lights up. Red or green or orange. And it would be really pretty. Really pretty. Because I know that uh, some of the Nissans, uh, the three, especially the 370Z here, sometimes I'll show you. Okay, sometimes, and the door here, okay, and the door here, this Z symbol right here, some of them lights up. And they're not crappy like this, they're actually like smooth with it. And they light up. I thought that was really pretty. I drove one before and I seen it. 
it was like a not completely red but it's kind of, kind of orange red So I can't wait till that car drop. I would like to go pick one up. Uh, this is my car. It's still worth like right around 17, 18,000. It's got 80,000 miles in it. Another thing is Nissan's really smart of uh, making a variety. I I like that smart idea. Is this when Nissan dropped Z's? Okay, they also drop variety in them. They drop convertible. They drop automatic. They drop stick. Or well, some people prefer it manual. Okay, they're really smart of doing that because. They know that people like their own type, okay? Just like us, we all love women, but guys have their variety also. Some like it fat, some like it skinny, some like it tall, some like it short, uh, you name it. So when we make car, we have to make variety, so it, it will make sense, right? Just like the, the Supra. If the new the Supra when they dropped in, they drop they drop stick and automatic. Holy shit, man! People won't complain too much. But I'm not here to talk about the Supra. It's it's pretty much all BMW. They should have keep it to themselves. So yeah. Anyway, I'm here to talk about the new one, and that's. I thought about it, I, and, and uh, I think that uh, if they have the VTEC with the turbo, it will be super nice. It's gonna be a super kick-ass ride. I'm uh, really happy to uh, see that they're gonna be doing production soon. And yeah, go get it, guys. You want one, go get it. Save up your money, save up your down payment, okay? You're gonna need at least 3,000 or 5,000 for your down payment, okay? Don't forget that. You want one, start to save it up. Put money in your cookie jar or something. All right, guys. That's all for me. I usually don't do things like this. I uh, mainly just doing like video games. But I, I like Nissan so much that I have to have my share in it. Because they're gonna drop a nice car, I want performance. Let's make it uh, legendary, huh? Yeah. Let's make this new car to be legendary, to be remembered for a long time to come. Alright guys, I'm out. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys on video games. You guys got any question or comments, you guys can leave it below. Or you guys can come and talk to me on my live stream games. I usually live stream almost every night, hours and hours. So the people that already subscribe to me, they know how I am. I always play video games. Mostly I just play Call of Duty Ghost, like good games like the old days. I think Activision just throwing games out there nowadays to make money. I don't think they care if it's nice or not. Uh, I've been playing pretty much every Call of Duty in my life. Uh, some of them, I just buy it because I support Activision a lot. I buy every game they drop so far, but 
I don't think I'm gonna buy any more game for Activision from them anymore. Starting this year, no more. Because lately, after Call of Duty goes, every game that I bought, I put in for five hours, and then I, I don't know. I don't know what I did to them. Maybe uh, I, I break them. I don't know. I, I showed up my ass. I don't know. To tell the truth. And I say that all the time, just not on the, this video, if you catch me on a video game, I tell everybody the same. They don't make good game anymore. Um, like I said before, I'm sorry about that. I have to talk about them because I started mentioning about them and I... I don't know. just want to talk about it, you know? I feel bad. So, all right, Nissan, keep it up. Your good work. I'll see you guys around. And thank God no more train. Whew.